Hey ladies, it's Chrissy Romine again, and I um, just want to talk about the fact that this little puppy is back ordered to the high heavens. I know it's um, rough, but I'm going to show you something. Um, well, first I want to just say this. Um, calm down. It is not the only amazing product that Unique has. It is amazing. It's uh, incredible. Um, but there are tons of other ones, and I am actually um, using other products, and I still have this. See? I know it's like the holy grail, but look, it's full. I still have one, and I'm not using it right now. <clears throat> so, we're going to tell you how to calm down and the in other incredible products that are going to fix this up. Okay, this is literally what I'm doing right now, every day, even though I have the other product, this Holy Grail product. I am using Divine Daily Moisturizer, Primer, I'm using BB Flawless, and I'm using a combination of the cream and pressed powders um, because I find it way better right now for the winter, and it's really, really good. Really good. Um, okay, so I'm just going to show you really quickly so you can... See, oh hey, you just fell. <laughs> Hold on, you just fell. Are you there? Okay, let's start this again. So, my daily routine. We're gonna do it really quickly, and we're just talking about the skin, not the rest of everything else right now. But so a little bit of the moisture moisturizer. <clears throat> Excuse me, I'm getting over a cold. Um. Best moisturizer I've ever had. Doesn't clog my pores. Is extremely light, but also does the job. I tend to have annoying, like T-zone, slightly oily, but also extremely dry in the winter. Like excessively dry. Like I need to move and not live in the Northeast anymore. Okay, moving on. Primer, just a little bit. This is, <laughs> I, I've, I've said this many times, this is, this is the product that I would tell anyone to try from Unique. Hands down, um, one of my favorites, and I have tried other primers, and the one I got was disgusting, it smelled funny, it didn't work, um, and it's the only other one I had tried, and I know tons of other people who literally uh, love this product. It's a game changer. It makes all your makeup stay, it fills in the cracks, it's amazing. Okay, just a teeny, teeny bit, rub that all on. Now, I am right now in between, uh, well, kind of in between two colors of the BB Flawless, which is BB Flawless is our BB cream, which is kind of like a tinted moisturizer. Um, need lots of extra moisture. Put a little bit of this primer in my hair because it's fuzzy wuzzy. You fell again. Apparently my window is too cold. So I'm just going to leave you there. That okay? Okay. So I'm using two different primers, I mean two different BBs, but that's fine because when I'm um, pale, I'm bisque, and when I'm a little bit um, tanner, I'm honey, and I'm kind of in between right now. I mean, I am pale, Hello. but um, I'm kind of in between and I'm liking it, and I don't mind having two because I will use both of them at different points. All right, so I'm combining them a little bit, okay, and I'm going to apply this on my face. So moisturizing. Doesn't make me feel greasy though, which um, could be a concern to some people. And now, this is a tinted moisturizer. It has decent coverage, but it's not, uh, it might be for somebody who doesn't necessarily deal with acne, is not really trying to cover too much. Um, unfortunately, I do have a little bit of um, adult acne, so um, there are things that I want to cover a little better than just this. I do think it's a great product, but it's not necessarily one of our most covering. So, there you are again. I then have used the cream powder, uh, the cream powder here, I mean the cream powder, the cream foundation, <clears throat> and I am using taffeta. And this right here is the money. You see how that is totally gone? The little imperfection I had, I use it under my eyes. And I kind of tap mine a little bit. Like I said, I tend to have dry skin, so I don't want to, like, rub. Um, but this cream foundation is fantastic. Okay. 
don't know if you can see already the difference in the coverage. I mean, this is like mega coverage. I love this. Actually, this was one of the last products that I tried. I'm not gonna lie. The cream foundation. I don't. I didn't really think much of it, but um, it is the best coverage. And it gives me, so I just use it in the areas that I want to blend. I want to cover a little bit more. And then if I'm having a day where I'm a little bit, a little oil in the tea spots, I don't always use this, but then I will sometimes use the powder foundation and kind of just dab in those areas. A little extra coverage and um, oil control. Guys, that's it. I love it. Then I'm going to do the rest of my routine which is only going to take me another two minutes or so. So, calm down. Don't stress. I know some of them aren't coming back until March. It's okay. I know it's a bummer, but it is okay because these other products are not lesser than. I promise you, I am obsessed with them right now, especially for winter skin. Go grab them. You need a BB. You need moisturizer. You need the primer. And you need either the cream and or powder foundations. You will thank yourself.